But with that, let's also bring you some important corporate commentary coming in. Auto Major Hero Motocorp recently underwent a leadership change. New CEO Niranjan Gupta spoke with our colleague Parikshit about the recently introduced voluntary retirement scheme as well as the CAPEX plans for this year. So let's listen in to that conversation. From time to time, every company has to go through refreshing talent churn in order to ensure that the talent is future ready and future fit. We had not done that in Hero for a long time. And therefore, we felt the need to actually refresh our talent so that it provides, as I said, the talent needs to be fit for the next 5, 7, 10 years' time. And it was that exercise which was done, which was the management VRS. Overall, around 10% of the staff took the VRS. And that paves the way for the future uh, in terms of building the organization. Much simpler organization, delayed, simplified, which will ensure that the speed at which we move will be much faster than what we have been doing. Given the framework of EV that's changing rapidly, whether it's in terms of customer, whether it's in terms of uh, regulatory, or the battery side, the cost side, uh, or the fame that, that everyone is aware of, I can only say that don't go by the current leadership in the market it's going to change dramatically over the next three years. And typically, we have given the guidance of between 1,000 to 1,500 crores a year. That's the range of CapEx guidance. So therefore, more and more investment out of this pie uh, will be towards an EV and premium. All right, that was just a tiny snippet for you. In fact, remember, you can catch XFs from our conversation with Hero Motors, new CEO Niranjan Gupta, all day today right here on CNBC TV 18. With that, we do need to get into a short break. But on the other side, we're going to talk all about what's going on with the commodities. So stay tuned for that.